Hi, I'm Latika Tukral. I'm a co-founder of I Am Gurgaon. Uh, we've been using waste to make features in our projects. Uh, we started in a small way with one of our first projects called Chakrapur Wazirabad Band. As we started working on the pathway, we realized that we were buying broken bricks to put under for the foundation. And that got us thinking that why are we not using construction debris thrown around the city? Then this excitement took over and we have been using waste in all our projects, which are something like five or six for now. We were so fortunate to work with architects like Nidhi Madan, who was so, so excited about using waste. Whatever waste came her way, she turned it around. We found concrete debris, concrete cubes from cube tests in construction. We found uh, broken stones, broken tiles. Larger pieces of stone that we found became the building blocks of the seat wall. And then we used uh, the smaller pieces with different colors to create a pattern within. We used the broken uh, tile in different combinations of colors and patterns and textures and different cut angles to create the paving band that ran all the way through the site. This is a gabion wall. It's typically made out of wire frame and filled with stone. Here we used old tree guards to create the framing and a mesh to close seal it off and then we filled it with the waste concrete and waste brick and stone and whatever we found on site. One of the huge challenges was actually finding people who would work with old waste. We went through 30 teams of welders before we found one that would actually work on it and try to achieve what we were trying to do with waste and create the gabion walls. The project Bachapur Forest Corridor is an example of how the waste can be used in, in multiple ways. Uh, and then this journey continued with other architects also, like Raghavan, Kavita Jain, who have taken all these materials, any kind of waste materials, to use in projects like Sikandapur Forest Corridor, Khata Band, and who took this journey to the next level. So this area was a construction debris dump yard, and these five pipes were lying there. So we were wondering what to do with them. These pipes were in very bad shape, so we decided to give it a function and a purpose. So the land above, was, there was a lot of erosion taking place, so we used the pipes as a retaining structure, refurbished the edges, and what you get finally is a cozy seating dish within a pipe with an expansive view of the greens. Actually, we should do a precise calculation on how much waste has been used in all our projects. But if I were to just take a guesstimate, I would think that 1,000 truckloads of waste would have been used in our projects, of which 500 would be this construction debris. So the design process involved sorting out from the, all the construction debris that was lying on the site, and that informed our design decisions. So like the smaller pieces, we used it under the pathway. Slightly bigger pieces, we used it as edging. If you see the walls here, they're all made of mulba. And the very large pieces, we used it as breakers uh, of rainwater. There is a particular place we even used it to make a waterfall. So the users were varied, uh, depending on the context that it was used for. We came across this uh, mulba slope here and it was framed by these two lovely people trees. So in fact, we transformed the space, removed all the malwa, and actually used the stones from the site, which was an abandoned quarry. So you can see the transformation spatially of a malwa filled site into a beautiful seating. You know, when you start using waste, you just get addicted to it. And we also realized that the cost of the project comes down by 30%. The way we have used waste in five of our projects, 
clearly demonstrates that it is replicable, but it is also environment friendly. If this waste was not used in one of our projects, I am sure it would have been lying around in the forest area or choking some of the drains and polluting the city. Today, we feel great about getting an opportunity to use waste in all our projects. Our corporates, our uh, administration has allowed us this use of waste and uh, it just feels great to be able to do that. We can either choose to send all the waste we find to landfills or we can choose to create places like this for everyone in the city.